Hi friends, in this video we are going to see the concept of balance of payment. Balance of payment is a systematic record of economic transactions between residents and non-residents of a country for a specific time period. This definition of balance of payment tells that BOP that is balance of payment is a systematic record as this is a record and there should be maintainer of it and this record is maintained by central bank of every country. In case of India, this record is maintained by RBI. Second one, as per IMF manual BMP6, every central bank has to maintain the record of balance of payment as per the International Monetary Fund manual that is IMF manual BMP6. Every central bank has to maintain record as per this manual and all amounts expressed in this record should be in dollars. All amounts are expressed in dollars, American dollars. As we see that balance of payment is a systematic record, but record of what? So, balance of payment is a systematic record of economic transactions between residents of country and non-residents of country. This is a very important thing that this is the record between residents of country and non-residents of country. Residents and non-residents, these are two different concepts. Don't confuse them with citizens and non-citizens of India. These are different. Residents are those persons who are residing residing in India for a specific time period of for a specific time. Although they are not a citizen of India, but they can become a residents of a country or residents of India. So these are different concepts: residents and non-residents. Uh, these are different from citizens and non-citizens. So this is the record between economic transactions between residents of country and non-residents of country. And it is for a specific time period and generally that time period is for a one year. So it is clear that balance of payment is a systematic record of economic transactions between residents and non-residents of a country for a specific time period. From this definition, you should have got the main idea about the balance of payment. But this definition doesn't tell us that what are the components or what are the elements of balance of payments so in this slide here you can see that balance of payments and its components so balance of payment has two main components first one current account and second one is capital account current account and capital account are the main components of balance of payments and current account has its subparts as well and capital accounts has subparts but mainly balance of payments is divided into these two parts current account and capital accounts in case of india there is a deficiency in current account and surplus in capital account why this is so 
we will see in next video but here you have to keep in mind that balance of payment and its components what are the components there are mainly two components current account and capital account these are the main components and here you can see that how these components are classified and what are the contents you can see here